Well, hello and welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna be doing my August budget. I did just recently post my July budget, but I was so late in posting it that my goal for the month of August was to put up the stupid budget before the month of August begins. So I'm hoping future Emily will get this up for you before August begins. So anyway, Let's look back at July. So this was my budget for July, has all the information on it. I break it down. I'm clearly a decorative planner person. So I break it down by household, cash, and then extras, and then my total over here. And I like to decorate it because then, you know, I kind of stick to it at that point. I don't share my income. I know I get a lot of questions about that. I don't share my income and I don't share like progress videos either. I know there's other people on YouTube that do that. I'm just not one of them. So I know I just get a lot of questions about that in these budget videos. So anyway, let's get started. I actually already started by doing this. I actually did this for all the months already because I got really excited and um, yeah, so they're already all like decorated on the top, but uh, clearly not done. So moving forward, that's what you'll see. I am currently using an Erin Condren binder. I do use an hourly version. So this is actually a week that happened before, but it is an hourly layout, which I love. So um, that's what I chose. And then I have it in the colorful version. There's also a neutral version too, which is kind of more of a gray, like pastel-y scale, which is also very beautiful. And if you're interested in any Erin Condren products, I will um, have the links down below for you guys. So. I like to pull this out because it's so much easier for me to write on. So I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna move this off camera um, somewhere. I don't think you guys can see my mess. I have a huge mess in front of me, but that's off camera, so yeah. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna move that off camera, maybe, 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 oh no. We're gonna zoom in anyways, because we need to. Ta -da, da -da 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 -da. All right, let's go out a little bit more. Out a little bit more. Okay, cool. All right, so anyway, here's my budget page. And um, this has actually been working really well for me doing the budget in my life planner versus before I will leave um, somewhere in a card or down below or something, um, a link to my budgeting series, or it's I think it's called my Money Talk playlist. So I used to actually use a totally separate planner for my finances, and that just became like really cumbersome for me. And now that they have you know some different page options and things like that in the new life planners, as well as the binders, I had this page at the very beginning of the month and I'm like, well, I'm not using anything for it. Why don't I just do that? So anyway, it worked really well this past July and you know, I'm hoping moving forward it'll work really well as well. Wow, that's a lot of wells. Okay, let's move on. I am going to put everything in. I need to grab my stickers. Where are they? Oh goodness. I got my red stickers, which is what I want to use for this one. And then I have other things I want to use. I'm just going to pull out all my all the stickers I would like to use this month before I get started. Usually I do it while I'm going, but you know what? Today's a new day. It's, it's time to it's time to figure it out, everybody. <laughs> I'm not I'm not the best at this sometimes. A little bit of a, a little bit of a hot mess. So the majority of the stickers I'm gonna to use today are from Coffee Break Planner. There is actually a discount code below if you'd like to shop. Um, these are some of my favorite stickers. If you guys uh, follow me on Instagram or Facebook, you will see in my like spreads that I use them all the time. These are the quarter event scalloped boxes and she has a billion different colors and just came out also with half boxes in the same colors that she offers. So I'm just so excited for these. I won't be using any of these in this, but I just figured I'd mention it because they're sitting over here and they came the other day. So yeah. But um, all right, well, let's get this going. I am going to speed up this footage for you guys and then we will chat at the end. So cue the music.
I am done. Wow, that took a while because I screwed up a bunch of stuff as you guys could probably tell. So anyway, I wanna talk a little bit about me for just a quick second. I know a lot of people click onto this video and they've never watched any of my videos, but if you made it this far, welcome. Um, I am Emily. I am single. I live alone. I have a dog. I also have a small business, which is you guys. Uh, it's, you know, like my YouTube income and other things as well. So um, I don't pay out of this budget, I don't pay my cell phone bill or my internet bill. That's all done through the business expenses. So that being said, let's run through this really quickly because my battery is dying. So as for my household, my mortgage is 46709. Oh, I should also say, um, I also live in Minnesota. Anyways, um, if you have questions about the mortgage and why it is so low, I will link my mortgage details video up above for you guys. My HOA, I do live in like a townhome complex and it is 158. My gas is an estimate of $47. My call again, I do uh, rent a water softener because the water is not that great in my area. So it's 32.81. My electric estimate is around $80. My garbage and recycle is 17.85. My water estimate is $55. Auto insurance is 95.08 and my Netflix is $13.95, which brings me to $9.66.78. As for my cash categories, uh, my grocery is going to be about $2.50. I am going on a road trip this month, so I docked it $50 and I added the other $50 to the dining because clearly I'm going to be going out. So my dining budget is at $2.50 and my fuel, which I actually don't use cash for, I just like do the pay at the pump, is $1.80, which brings me to $6.80 for that category. And then my extras this month, um, my state fair is coming up in the month of August and that I allocate $80 for. Road trip is gonna be about $400. I'm splitting all of the costs with my mom. We're going to Niagara Falls. And then paint and miscellaneous, which will be like any supplies I need or whatever. I'm gonna be painting my kitchen cabinets coming up very soon. And that's gonna be about $200. I'm thinking like maybe about 180, but I wanted to put a little bit of buffer in there. So that brings me also to 680. So my total budget for the month is $2,326.78 sense. So that is it for me. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Feel free to subscribe. I do these videos every single month, as well as different like decorative planning videos and lifestyle, other things, random vlogs, all that good stuff. But yeah, that's it for me. Thank you guys so much for hanging out and I will see y'all in the next one. Bye guys. Well folks, it's time to kick it old school. Uh, so you can feel cool. <laughs> Yeah.